Explain how hormone rejuvenation works versus bioidentical and, and things like that. It's a very good question. It's, it's exactly where we need to go right now. Is um, If you take a bioidentical or synthetic hormone, you are taking a medication, a drug. There is nothing natural about either one of them. Bioidentical is claimed to be natural, but it's compounded. As soon as you compound something, it becomes synthesized, it's synthetic, okay? So what happens is the body builds up the toxicity of it and because the adrenal glands and the hypothalamus pituitary adrenal axis and the ovaries and that whole connection, the, the innate intelligence in a person's body knows that they need to make their own hormones. The adrenal glands also makes, its own, makes our hormones. So when you are pumping hormones into your body, the adrenal glands stop making their own hormones, which ages you, mm -hmm. ages you. Not anti-aging at all. See, the adrenal glands get really tired and they go to sleep. Just like if you took a thyroid medication, uh, which they have thyroxine in it, just like at that. When you take that, then the thyroid is put to sleep. I mean, not vegetative, not functioning true with any hormone. So what happens is you put your body into a vegetative state and that is very unhealthy and it accelerates the aging. Women gain weight from synthetic and bioidentical and the stuff you find in health food stores mm -hmm. as well. They gain weight and it could be they could gain weight in two days. They could notice a difference in their body. So the homeopathic hormone reju rejuvenation has no side effects, doesn't make you gain weight can't elevate, can't depress, it brings it to normal whether it's high or low, and that's the beauty of homeopathy. If a baby got a hold of the liquid and, and, um, and if the baby got a hold of the liquid and ate it, nothing bad would happen.